Hey folks, consider yourselves lucky. If you were in one of my on-ground classes, you would have to deal with this chicken scratch on the board every day. Now, uh, I know it's the beginning of the semester, and I imagine you have other courses, and you have me throwing language at you like rhetoric and cultural myths, and there's just a lot of stuff that's coming at you right now. So I wanted to take a moment or two to hopefully clarify exactly what we will be doing over the next few weeks so that you have a strong understanding of the end goal. And so let's take a look at this chicken scratch. Uh, in the first unit for the course, uh, I'll introduce you to this concept of rhetoric, and more specifically, I'd like to introduce you to the rhetorical appeals. And so there are three that many of us uh, may already be familiar with, and that's logos, pathos, and ethos, uh, the logic, the emotions, and the character or credibility. Uh, and I'm adding this fourth one, this mythos or mythos, and you can think of that as the, the language of cultural myths or cultural narratives, uh, some of the concepts that are being talked about in the first reading. And now, we're going to use these concepts in a variety of ways. Uh, specifically, we're going to do two things. We're going to see how all of these concepts here play out in writing. And when I say writing, we're going to be looking at a specific genre of writing. Uh, the op-ed, um, the uh, opposite the editorial, the sort of argument that you may see in a newspaper or magazine. And so we're going to see how authors of these sorts of writing use these concepts to build strong cases. Uh, we're also going to have larger conversations. We're going to have discussion board conversations about these concepts in the real world. That is beyond just this genre of the op-ed. And so we're doing these two things because the hope is that these two activities here are going to inform the first major project. And in the first major project, I invite all of you to craft your own op-ed on a subject of your choice, on a cultural narrative of your choosing. And uh, you're going to write as if it would be published in the Miracosta newspaper. And so for the first part of the major assignment, everyone in the class is going to craft their own about thousand word op-ed. And in the second part of that assignment, everybody is going to analyze, analyze excuse me, the logical strength and rhetorical effectiveness of a classmate's op-ed. So here are all the concepts. Here's the end goal. Welcome to the next few weeks. Take care.